everyone. Welcome to my channel. Myself, Mrinalani Mahato, MCA with UGC Net Exam Qualified. In this video, I am going to share with you DBMS UGC Net Exam previous year question. Let's start. This is a question number 6. For a weak entity set to be meaningful, it must be associated with another entity set in combination with some of their attribute values is called as option A, never set, option B, strong entity set, option C, honor entity set, option D, weak set. This question is asked in June 2015. So first you must know about that. What is entity set? Entity set, it is a collection of all entities of a particular entity type. Particular entity type. That means it is a similar type of entities are there. Similar type of entities are there. And then we can say that it is an entity set. And if you want to know about that, what is entity type? So then you will go to the question number 5. I have explained there what is entity type. So for a weak entity set to be meaningful, weak entity set denoted by the double rectangular box. It is a meaningful and what is called weak entity set? Weak entity set do not have own key attribute. It do not have own key attribute it is called weak entity set so it must be the meaningful it must be associated with another entity set another entity set another entity set so this is the another entity set and it is called strong entity set why weak entity connected to the strong entity set weak entity cannot connect to weak entity set okay so weak entity connected always to the strong entity set and strong entity and weak entity connected by the identifying relation C. Identifying relation C. Okay. So it must be another entity set in combination with some of their attributes value. This is the strong entity and what is called strong entity? Here is given a strong entity set. Strong entity has own key attribute. Own key attribute it is called strong entity set strong entity set so weak entity has do not have own key attribute and strong entity has own key attribute and if any entity set in the combination with some of their attributes value to be meaningful of weak entity set. So here in the so many attributes are there in the strong entity and if it is supported to meaningful by the weak entity set so then we can say that this type of entity is called honor entity set. What is called honor stand, uh, entity set and honor entity set another name is identifying entity set. What is called identifying entity set and strong entity set another name is regular entity set okay regular entity set so how you will be described with that which one is strong entity set which one is honor entity set strong entity set only has own key attributes and it is not supported to the any weak entity set Okay, it is called strong entity set, otherwise regular entity set. And if any strong entity set, it is supported to the weak entity set. So that time this is strong entity set called as honor entity set, otherwise identify entity set. So you can now say that honor identity, honor entity set, otherwise identifying entity set, it is a part of strong entity set. Strong entity set. But every strong entity set, it is not an honor entity set. Okay? And never set, it is not an any type of entity set. Weak set, it is also not an any type of entity set. Okay? So, shortcut also I told you that never set, weak set, it is not any type of 
any entity set ha huh, weak entity set is there weak entity set is there but only weak set it is not an any entity set okay so you must be confused strong entity set otherwise owner entity set so strong entity set i told that many times strong entity set otherwise regular entity set it has own key attribute only but it is not supported to the weak entity set but owner entity set it is supported it is supported to the weak entity set so it is called an owner entity set and if you want to know the diagrams er model diagrams with the description then you will go to the question number 1 i have explained there so this is the explanation part if you want to write it in your notebook so that pause at the video and write it i have explained everything and that things i have written here so our correct answer is option number c i think guys you must have understood everything thank you for watching my video